Hi guys, welcome to PCN's channel. So we are trying out Halo Infinite today uh, on the NVIDIA GeForce GTX 1660 Ti. The machine I'm using this on is uh, Asus ROG Zephyrus G14, which has a, a 1080p display and a 120Hz screen. So we're going to set the minimum frame rate to... Uh, actually, let's, let's, let's set the minimum to 30 here. I don't know how good Ultra is going to be, but we'll put the maximum up to 120. We'll put VSync on... Uh, graphics graphic graphical uh, preset is the highest it can go so this literally is as as high as this can put out so we've got it on ultra um so let's see how this performs uh, i've got the frame rate in the top right so uh, let's go into game and see how well it does okay guys we're in game as you can see right from the bat we're we're under 60 fps i saw 54 there when we started the game and and we're kind of hovering a little bit below so uh Let's just have a quick blast. I'm really hoping Halo, sorry, Halo lets me uh, lets me uh, change the graphics on the fly. Okay, so uh, let me go into a corner and let's see if we can uh, change the graphics. Okay, guys, we are putting the graphics down one to high. Oh, cool. Okay, they should do it on the fly. So let's go back in game and hopefully that takes effect. Frame rate is still okay. I don't know uh, if that stuttering we saw there was because I'm changing the frame rate on the fly. Okay, that's a bit disappointed by that. Let me let me go down another preset. Okay, so what we're we're on medium now, and it's 60. But we really wanted to see like a, a high frame rate. Oh look, there's an arcade here. Nice. Right, let's put it down some more. Alright, okay, so we're on the lowest now. And to be honest, I'm, I'm not seeing much of a difference. Um, I'm not sure if the game has to be restarted. I really was uh, hoping to get 120 FPS, you know, even if it was on low. Okay, guys, so I've just restarted the game. I've gone on uh, the low preset. Uh, now, bear in mind, uh, I do have boost off on this. Um, i just turned it off just, just to kind of... Uh, so just the machine produces less heat and then the fans are a, a little quieter. Um, I'm sure with boost we could get a few more frames per second. But for me, the trade-off in noise... And uh, so the trade-off in uh, in noise and the extra heat isn't quite worth it. So I always run my Zephyrus with boost off. But um, we are getting over 60 FPS constantly on low. And to be honest, um, there is a difference in the visual quality. But I, I still find it, you know, looking very nice on, on the lowest preset. So, um, yeah, I really hope they... Um, they make this compatible with integrated graphics as well because I really want to play it on a, my handheld uh, GPD Win Max. You know, as you know, if you're a follower of the channel, you, you know that I really enjoy handheld gaming. Uh, but that was it for this uh, Halo uh, Infinite multiplayer video. If you enjoy the content, consider subscribing. Drop me a like if you like. And guys, as usual, uh, I'll see you next time. PCN out.